What's up guys, David Hoffman here from David's Been here coming at you from <laughs> Clutch Burger with my boy Steve, the owner of Clutch Burger. Guys, and welcome, welcome. What are we doing, what are we doing? Today we're gonna get a little crazy. We're thinking outside the box since he's so famous over there in India. We're <laughs> gonna do two different Indian style burgers. One's called the David's Hoffman Burger, or David's Been here, the DBH Burger. <laughs> Cut. You're killing me, you're killing me. <laughs> so we're making two burgers today. David's been here Gurra Masala Burger and the David's been here Gunpowder Burger. Both these spices come from Ulava Churu Tiffins, a friend of mine, Lata, the owner of the restaurant in the, in the Bay Area. She employs her village, basically a coastal village in Andhra Pradesh. She employs lots of women who, you know, make these beautiful spices. So Gurra Masala, what is Gurra Masala? Well, Gurra means warming. It's so like warming spice in Hindi. Eight different spice blends. Wow. You have cardamom, cinnamon, it cloves. Really. It's, delicious. it's amazing. Right? This one's a little, this one's a gunpowder. It's a little bit more kick to it, a little more spice. A little more spice, right? So this one, uh, it's a little spicier. As you can see, it's red. And this one's gonna be the veggie burger. Wow, look at that. Uh, yeah. I'll take one of these little blocks right here. Yeah, it's, it's unique. I've actually never tasted anything like it. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to throw that on our possible burger. So we're gonna do one with meat, one without. Mm -hmm. The gunpowder is gonna be on the one that's without meat, right? So exactly. spicy. The veggie burger. So we're gonna get in there and we're gonna get creative. Yeah. We're just gonna go go with it. Yeah? Do you have anybody in the back? Anyone's gonna help us back there? We'll find out. <laughs> All right, let's go inside. All right. All right, let's go. All right, we ready? We ready, rock and roll? Ready. So what do we have there? Uh, it's a nice little eight ounce chuck brisket sirloin fatty. We're gonna get it nice and seared on both sides. I prefer going medium rare, so we're gonna do about a minute on each side. We're gonna cheese it. I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do it with this rub. A nice little coating, nothing too much. So it's got a lot of scent to it, a lot of taste to it, a lot of flavor. We're gonna go with the brioche bun on this. We get them delivered here every day. Okay. So that's another uh, selling point. It's, they're always fresh. Our baker has a key here. <laughs> My man, you good? Yeah, I'm good, baby. You ready for the burger? Ready to rock and roll. Oh, man. Oh, get a nice little butter on there. My little, my little trick here, give it a couple spins, you know? DJ it. Yeah, I'm like, I feel like I'm DJing right now. Goldish brown. Mm -hmm. See how fast that went? That was quick. 15 seconds. I'm going to leave it right here because it's nice and hot. This should have a good sear. Oh, I'm going to hit it on this side now. Oh, double. Oh yeah, both sides, baby. Oh, you can smell the cinnamon coming off of it right now. It's just so oh, right? glorious. I haven't had that scent in this kitchen before, so kind of got a little, little food shelf going on right now. <laughs> smell like an Indian kitchen. You know, for me, that's what makes this girl masala, that cinnamon. Oh, yeah. The cinnamon, the cardamom, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's early, it's 10 in the morning. Woo! He's I alive, he's alive. I haven't had a beer yet. <laughs> well, he has great beer here, by the way. Oh, yeah, great selection. Oh, man, this is going to be awesome. I can't wait. So, what are we going to throw on here? Well, what's your idea on this burger? Because we're, we're like making this out of freestyle, you know? We're making a real authentic, I guess, clutch burger. Yeah, yeah, clutch burger. On the go, on the go. Fresh arugula on there, boom. And we're not going to make it too saucy because obviously we don't want that to overtake the taste, right? We want this beautiful girl masala. That, oh, wow. Medium rare right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give it a nice little flip. So what's cool is here we do all of our meat on the on the plancha, on the flat top, and any of our impossible non-meat products we do on our grill. Okay. We're able to keep it separate for anyone that has specific uh, you know, reasonings or whatever it might be. So now I always throw the tomato and the lettuce on the bottom because a lot of people throw it on top, but it actually acts as kind of like a, a barrier from the grease dripping down from the eight ounce patties. You should, if you don't have that base of the lettuce and tomato, it's gonna sink right into that bun. I got my little egg ring right here. Woo! That's right. There we go. Oh, beautiful. That is a beautiful. Pepper Jack? Steam it, melt that cheese in under 10 seconds. 10 seconds, that's it? Yeah, 10 seconds, it'll be the garam masala. Okay, I'm gonna throw more, more garam masala on. Just a little bit on the top. Okay, a little bit on the top, perfect. So we put it on both sides of the patty, and then we added cheese. Now we're gonna add the egg. Look at that, oh. I were to be ordering this burger, I would throw some bacon on it, but I understand that, you know, Bacon pork. Most Indians don't eat pork, so we're not gonna we're not gonna include that one on today's burger. I'm gonna, no. throw, I'm gonna I don't want to overcook it, so I'm gonna uh, let me do this. Here we go. Like that? Wow! Look at that egg. Egg's perfect. That one? Yeah. Need a little. I should have poured a little butter on there, but oh. Yeah. 
Oh, you flipped it. Uh, I'm gonna flip it, man. I'm gonna flip it. Oh, I got a little cut there. Okay. So, meat's ready. Set that there just so it doesn't overcook. So we're gonna add some raw onions. Perfect. Some more, girl. A little bit. This is a kick through this whole burger, every bite. Oh yeah, what a beauty. And then on top of this. What else can we add to it? This is a red piquillo pepper. Piquillo pepper. Yeah, beautiful. Boom. Mm. Pac-Man style. Boom. <laughs> now we have the first ever David's Ben Hair Burger at Clutch Burger. Let's, hey, let's cut it up. Let's see how it is. Let's split it open so we can see the exactly what it looks like. Look at that, nice medium, medium rare plus. All right guys, let's try this burger. Let's see if we love it. I'm sure we'll love it. It's gonna be good. Especially with those garam masalas, man. Brioche bun, arugula, mm -hmm. freshly sliced tomato, raw onions, eight ounce chuck brisket sirloin patty, pepper jack cheese, an egg, and a piquillo pepper. Nicely layered with the garam masala rub. Mm -hmm. And we sprinkled the top of the egg with it as well. So, all good. I'm ready. Salud, salud, salud. <laughs> I went in. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh, wow. I've never had a burger where you get a little bit of that cinnamon, mm -hmm. that coriander. That's, is that, there's coriander in there, right? Mm -hmm. like. Coriander seeds, cardamom, cloves. Mm. There's a lot going on in this burger, so I'm glad we put oh, wow. the amount that we did. Otherwise, it might have been a lot lost in there, you know what I mean? Exactly. Yeah, I think this is perfect, actually. In terms of how many different things are in here, you have so many different textures and flavors, mm -hmm. but the garam masala, you really feel it. It comes out, right? At this cinnamon, is, for me, is what, what makes this. Okay, wow. Mm -hmm. With the egg, it's That's almost like a, a breakfast uh, breakfast style burger. Mm -hmm. yeah. And if you're not, oh, you know, so good. If you're not against yeah. eating bacon, throw some bacon on here, that'd be great, too. It wouldn't offset that taste. But mm -hmm. it would definitely make it more of a breakfast style burger oh man it's amazing mm. i think the egg is the best part here too yeah like I on top of the, the texture the texture yeah mm -hmm. the texture gives that soft cushy exactly with the bread i mean the bun is so good nice and airy mm -hmm. Mm. Mm. oh yeah so now anybody can come in here in order that david's been here garam masala burger it's off menu you have to Secret let's me know yeah no people yeah, no people also, I would that. pair this with like a light, crisp beer, either Chris from Six Point Brewery, or I would go uh, Funky Buddha, which is local. I'll go with their vibing. That'll be a great uh, lager, yeah. Or if you uh, come in here and we have the little panga drops, that you love drops. those, bro. Mm -hmm. My favorite. A little Nicaraguan Pilsner, 6.2%. All would pair great with this. Dude, I hate saying it. It's my favorite burger here. <laughs> it like, literally is my favorite burger here. That was, that was really good. so good, man. I couldn't wait. I don't know. I think the next burger we make. The next one? Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's do it. Break. Gum powder. Gum powder. You gotta say, that was amazing. One of my favorite burgers of all time. Dude, so good. That was so good. Was so, so good. Fun. I can't even believe how good it Bravo, was. Bravo, David Ben here. <laughs> Bravo. Oliver right. Churro Tiffin, Gurma Masala, the best. So this one we're gonna use. Yeah, it looks like meat, but it's not. It's called impossible for a reason. But it looks and tastes just like meat, yeah. Possible meat. It's a little scrapey. It's fine. Let me get that gunpowder. That gunpowder. All right, this rub is a, has a little bit more kick to it, so we're not going to do too much. It's a gentle. It's like reddish orange. Yeah. You can tell it's spicy. Some salt in here. Not too much. Oh man, it's going to be good. Put the bun again. Butter that bun. Mm -hmm. I like that little bread. that little wheel, huh? Uh -huh. It's for the rats. Wheels, for the little. <laughs> yeah, it's all about that DJ on the flat top. Put the, put the, put the, put. <laughs> See? Yes. I don't know. What are you thinking? I don't know, man. Maybe some pickled onions on this one. Pickled onions. Got a little bit of that speed, that spice, yeah. yeah arugula. 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 I think we're gonna skip the tomato on this one. I think we should. This is our Telesio fondue. So we take Telesio cheese, which is a very soft. Italian cheese, it's expensive, it's bougie. Uh, we cut it up, we melt it down, wifey, I don't know what she does. <laughs> yeah. she, does she does crazy stuff, I don't even know, nobody knows. Uh, and she turns it into this Legio fondue. We use it on our clutch burger, we use it on a few of our other uh, appetizers, but it's, you, you understand why we're using it, it's ridiculous. Oh, you gotta be gentle with this meat, because it's not meat. <laughs> 
Oh, look at that, yeah. So we're gonna do a little bit more gunpowder. You can see oh, that, yeah. that seasoning kind of taking over. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Oh, that oh looks, looks good. great. Caramelized onions. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. I like to use my hands so I can spread it out. So every bite has, has, the, has the same flavor profile for everything. I hate going to places where it's you eat, you eat halfway into the burger and then you start chopping into some of the flavors. A little bit of this. Oh. oh yeah, right there. Oh yeah, right there. That's like this. Oh, oh, get it right here. Let it sit there. We're gonna do a little bit of garnish on top, like we did with your David Benjamin burger. We're gonna throw a little bit more. Oh uh, yeah, like, almost like a paprika. Now we're gonna flip it to my bird, my bun. Oh yeah, straight to the bun. Uh, so this is a little more simple, but it's going to have a lot of flavor. I'm super excited about this. You guys are going to love this. And uh, you're going to love it a lot. Here we go. Here we go. It's going to be great. The burger. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's cut this guy in half. All right. Oh, I'm excited for this one. gunpowder burger. The first one ever here, guys. How beautiful it's going to so be. I'm going to walk you guys through this, okay? This is the brioche bun, arugula. There's no tomato. Impossible patty. Yes, it does look and taste like oh, meat. Yeah. And you can get it cooked to temperature. So if you want it medium. Oh, wow. Look at that. See how that's medium? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's ironic because obviously it's not meat, but you can get a medium burger. Some people don't like it because they, they hate the color of blood or pink or whatever. Yeah. I'm ready, guys. Let's, in there. Let's go. Let me see. Let's I'll go. That. Oh my god. Yeah. I know it's gonna be too good. Cheers. Cheers, cheers guys. So cheers. Good. Cheers. Bro. Mm-hmm. I like this one better. Mm-hmm. Me too. What the heck? The caramelized onions, right? Mm-hmm. Yo, I'm gonna make this with actual meat. Yeah. I was gonna say. So you have the oh. option, guys, just so you know. When you come to Clutch Burger, you can get the Impossible Burger meat in any of our burgers that we have. Mm. But this right here? Wow. Wow. What the hell? Super unique. Wow. It is. It's like the, the onions with the Deglazio. Mm-hmm. With the seasoning. Mm. I, what I was worried about was the caramelized onions because it that has a very potent, you know, it's, flavor. It's yeah. very, it's, mm -hmm. You know it's there when it's there. So I was worried that might... I'm sniffling. I'm just, it's got a decent kick to it, too. Yeah, the kick, right? So that's yeah. the gunpowder. It's nice. It's subtle. It's not like overbearing, right? Mm. Man, the caramelized onions with that fondue, wow. pressed with that impossible burger. <laughs> what a good burger. Wow. Both of these are my favorites. Yeah. The other burgers don't, don't compare. <laughs> <laughs> Come on down to David's Ben here, burger at 146 Geraldo. <laughs> well, now you guys know when you come to Clutch Burger, come ASAP. Order the David's Been Here Gunpowder or the David's Been Here Guru Masala. They're both amazing. Obviously, if you're strictly veg, you have to go with the gunpowder, but man, they're both so good. Yeah, and if the staff don't know what you're talking about, that's how top secret this thing is, right? Exactly. Steve, I'm exactly. Kidding. Everyone will know. But <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Definitely come by, try the burgers, support Ulavachura Tiffin. They're supporting local women in. Andhra Pradesh, which is a state in India, they literally support their families with the creation of these spices. Oh, what a great cause. Delicious spices. Oh, yeah. gosh, that was so good. I'm going to arm wrestle you guys for this one, huh? What's up? I'll take it, take uh, it, take it. That's good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm going to have a little Christian try. Christian, new kid. Ah, I wanted to take it. Ah, just kidding. Ah, ah. Hey, that's you can have it, you can have it, you can have it. Yeah. <laughs> You can never get the same burger. <laughs> it's good, right? That impossible patty is very impressive. It's impressive if you have the right rub on yeah, it. Yeah, the right rice. rub. Yeah. Wow. Which is what we do. This is fantastic. Gunpowder, wow. Hey. You, know you got you one guys, hour to remember You guys the kick butt in the kitchen. Yeah. Amazing, right? We did a great job. <laughs> oh my God. I can't even believe it. I can't believe how good it was. Yeah, that's, that's what we do at Clutch, baby. The clutch. Never basic. Clutch, baby. Always Clutch.